Kayla. Welcome to Kitty Cat Soul Food, a place to better understand and strengthen your connection to cats and kittens. In today's video, I thought it would be really fun to examine the perennial regions of male and female kittens and help you ultimately to better understand how to tell the difference between a male and a female kitten. Now, sexing neophytes, which are really young kittens, can be quite difficult at first, which is why in this video, I'm gonna be demonstrating on three-week-old Scottish Fold kittens. They're at that stage where I feel like it's pretty easy to tell the sex, and so I hope you find this video helpful, and don't forget to stay until the end because I'm gonna be including a quiz of another litter of kittens that are actually only two weeks old, and let's see if you guys are able to guess all of the sexes. To start off, let's identify the perennial region. The perennial region is the surface region in both males and females where two orifices are visible, the anus and the genitals. The anus is close to the tail and the genital orifice below. The easiest way to tell the difference between a male and female kitten is to create a visual representation of these orifices in your mind. In a female, the genital orifice is shaped much like a lowercase i, the dot being the anus and the line being the vulva. Some see this shape as a vertical slit or a teardrop. More noticeably than the shape though is the space between the anus and the vulva. In females, this distance between the anus and the vulva is typically 5 millimeters long, which is half of the length compared to the space between male kittens' anus and genitals. The area between these two is typically covered by a devoid of hairs over time, which can make it a lot more difficult to observe the difference. In a male kitten, the genital orifice looks quite different. The visual representation can be seen as the shape of a colon the upper dot being the anus and the lower dot being the penis. The most noticeable difference is the length between the anus and the prepus. This is typically around one centimeter in comparison with the female five millimeters. This area is occupied by the scrotum, which is often empty at birth. The testicles then descend into the scrotum in around three months following birth. The scrotum is covered in hair and usually looks triangular in shape as male cats get older. And that is how I examine the perennial region of both male and female kittens. I hope you now can also determine the sex of your kittens and let me know in the comments down below how did you do on the quiz. I would love to hear your score. Did you get 5 out of 5? As well, don't forget to like and subscribe for more weekly cat videos. And again, as always, thank you so much for watching and welcome to all of my new subscribers. I can't wait to share more cat videos with you all. Until next time, stay positive. Bye! you there.